Um, but uh, we are ready to uh, ready to start. Um, where's my save game? Okay, so auto save or my save? I'm gonna go with my save. Right. Hello and welcome back um, to Thimbleweed Park. I have no idea what I was doing. Um, okay, so I need to right. stay focused and solve this murder so I can do um, what I need to do. I am going to, as he was stuck in the sewers, try. Going into the places that I went in as the lady, whose name I've currently forgotten. Reyes, Reyes. down the back alley that was it. Um, so I'm gonna go in there. We interrupt our hostile takeover non-stop music with this important message. Strange signals are being transmitted by the government over the airwaves. We've taken over the radio station until they stop. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. Signal. Cool. All right. Radio. Hot dog. I'm not gonna eat the hot dog. But I could talk to Sandy. What can I do for you, honey? Um. What's up with the sheriff? He's kind of weird, Reno. Yeah, he's kind of a nut job, but nothing compared to the coroner. This whole <laughs> town has gotten downright weird in the last few years. Cuckooville. The coroner and the sheriff are the same person. Well, there might be some resemblance around the eyes. But that's <sighs> I keep about saying it. That. The sheriff does this annoying a Reno thing, and the coroner does an annoying a who. It pretty <laughs> much proves they're not the same person. Yes, because logic. How does this prove <laughs> they're not the same person? You're asking a lot of questions that probably shouldn't be asked. I'm a federal agent. That's my job. I've said too much already. Uh, ow. Oh. Um. Right. What's up with this town? Most of the stores are abandoned. Used to be the center of culture in the Tri-County area. Parties every night at the hotel. Celebrities visit the Edmund Mansion mansion. It was hard to not make money in those days. Of course, this was before my time. And since the pillow factory burnt down, the town is drying up faster than Dave's sex drive. Ain't that right, Dave? <laughs> I'd like to order some food. Sure. Everything's on the menu board. What do you want? Ooh. What is a Schweinhexer? I'll have Hi. a pie. Sorry. Dave ate the last piece. See, Dave? I told you a customer would want it. Those foreign city folks really love the pie. <laughs> but no, you said. We seen the last of the city folks. Let me have the pie. It was starting to go bad. Shut up, Dave. It always comes down to the pie. I'd like All to right. order some food. Sure. Everything's on the menu board. What do you want? Schweinhexer. I'll have the uh, Schweinsex. 
Sorry, honey. Foreign businessmen got the last one a few nights ago. Been a big rush on exotic foods these past few weeks. I'd like to order some food. Sure. Everything's on the menu board. What do you want? Why not tell me I'll what you actually salad. have? <laughs> Sorry. We're out of salad. Aphid scare. I'm guessing there's I'd just like rancid hot dogs. <clears throat> Everything's on the menu board. What do you want? I'll have a hamburger. Sorry, honey. Those hot dogs are about to go bad, and I can't open a new package of hamburgers until they are all gone. I'd like to order some food. Sure. Everything's on the menu board. What do you want? I'll have a hot dog. Good choice, honey. We're trying to move them out. Eat up, hon, while it's still hot. Mm. Oh. Okay, that is the worst hot dog I've ever eaten. I um gotta go. Hello. I wonder if you have to um. I feel better now. Eat all the hot dogs so you can get hamburgers for something. That seems rather silly. Might work. Sure. Okay. So, let's go back and have a quick look at the notepad to refresh ourselves and what we're supposed to be doing. We have literally done one thing. Okay, so find the murder weapon, fingerprint the murder weapon, get a finger trauma report. Find ID for the victim in the hotel, get face trauma report. Take a blood swab from the body. Find suspicious item with blood on it, get blood trauma Put three th reports in a restaurant. Found the tube. Find a map. Go talk to Dolores. Go talk to Ransom the Clown. And find mushrooms in the sewer. Cool. Okay, so we have a photo of the body. And that's about it. It's an empty soda bottle. Five cent deposit in Massachusetts, Hawaii, California... Okay, so, let's retrace my steps. Lots of super absorbent paper on this roll. One sheet is enough. One sheet? Do I have a sheet? No! What's it has a sheet? Okay, fine. That's a huge toilet. Seems out of scale. Welcome to Quickie Pal. Can I help you find anything? I don't have any mail. Wonder if I can recycle this. I found this bottle. I'd like five cents back for cleaning up the environment. Well, I'd like five cents from you for taking your bottle. <laughs> Just kidding. Quickie Pal humor. Here you go. Cool. I have a shiny nickel. Wonderful. Uh, right. Well, that was useful. What happens From a if six I... pack. You're supposed to cut them up before tossing them. Saves wildlife. Now I just have to find a garbage can. He doesn't want it. Okay. A flower from the cemetery. Okay. Ball blaster from Mucus Flem Games. Hmm, never heard of it. Ah. Hi, Sam. I can Let see me know you there, if I can lurking. help you find anything. Alright, so... Anything else? I've got an empty whiskey bottle. I wonder if I can recycle that as well. Give it to Leonard. How can I help you? Do you sell this brand of whiskey? Let me see. Yes, that looks like Willie's brand. Why? Is he in trouble? Does anyone else drink this brand of whiskey? Actually... No. He's the only one who can stand it. It's an empty can of Crockford's tuna heads. The good parts. Still has that fishy tuna head smell it's famous for. Let me know if I can help you with anything. I'm just trying to palm my rubbish off he on him. He doesn't it's quite want funny. it. <laughs> right. So. I'm still quite amused by my chainsaw. Um, photo, key card. Can't 
Oh, I got two. Okay, Don't forget so. to smile at the camera. My boss likes happy people. Lots of specks of dust, fingerprint tape, and shiny nickel now. Perfect. Right, I talked to him last time. So, wanna buy a fine? Let's have a look. See, is there anything else out here? No. Nope. That's the sheriff gonna tell us to bugger off until we get a map. Uh, okay, so. Let's go down B Street. Dumpster. Filled to the brim with smelly trash. Uh, use plastic rings. Saves and... wildlife. There we go. Perfect. We have done our recycling. I feel the pet store is for rent. Very virtuous. Because no one around <laughs> here has any pets. No, that's fine. Um I am just sort of wandering around at this point. Uh, I got so far in my three and a Ooh, hey there. long stream Let's it was last time. Where we can talk. Well, hi. Um, Welcome to Ricky's YouTube. So I'm just retracing my steps. Do you know anything about the body by the river? Oh, yeah. I heard about that. <laughs> and super sad. The poor guy. Can't imagine anyone from around here doing something so awful. <laughs> Are you sure you don't have any suspicions about the killer? Oh, no way, Jose. I don't believe for a second anyone in Thimbleweed Park is a killer. It had Aww. to be a drifter or one of those mean city folks passing through. Just promise to be careful who you trust. Oh, maybe you big city agents can't understand what it's like <laughs> to live in such a nice little town. How many but games I am I going to play people, that have a really and naive they are like person? Family in. to me. Some of them are a bit eccentric, sure, but I just can't picture any of them as a murderer. Hmm. Your new sign looks good. Oh yeah, I was just super grateful you feds came and helped me out with that. I was really stuck on picking a name. You city folk sure are slick with your wordplay and your machine washable suits. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. all for now. I don't need to don't go through all the conversation okay, options hun. again. Just holler if you need me. Because I asked that last time. Uh, okay, so phone. Shop that's closed. The doors are locked and nobody's Cade inside. It's closed. On the side. Ooh, speck of dust, speck of dust, speck of dust! Woohoo! Yay. Um, right. There's no path beyond this point. It just looks like unfinished temp part from a cut. If by look at you mean smell, I've already done that. Hey, Fabia! Good to see you. I am retracing my steps to see what I'm missing. Because <laughs> I'm clearly missing something. Uh, okay, so... Let's head down the other street and see what's down there. Also can't remember what I did last time either. <laughs> which is always quite funny. Uh, right. Ooh! No, I went in there. I'll come back to that. That's closed. Well, that was the post office. That's where I got my sticky tape. But that's a speck of dust. Woohoo! Um. You got any gluten-free really? donuts? Um. Oh yeah. Cheers. Lady asked about the mushroom. Asked about the mushrooms. Okay. Park guided tour. Um. Okay. Let me switch back to this lady. Okay. So I have toilet paper, a business card, cell phone, some specks of dust. What do I need? I need a blood sample <laughs> from the dead body. Toilet paper is super absorbent. Maybe that'll work. It's worth a try. I mean, I couldn't fingerprint it, so. Always worth a try. Oh, the audio is bad. Um, on the game or me?
I haven't changed any settings, but, you know, could be the Xbox. Ha! <laughs> I'm a chipmunk. Okay. Cool. I'd prefer to be a squirrel. That worked. Oh! I have a blood sample. Ew! It's soaked with a dead body's blood. That's gross. What a mess. <laughs> that is really gross. Okay, so old tree, end of trail. Okay, so there's nothing more down here. I really wish there was a quick way to get back to town. Wrong way. Come on, back up. Right. Zoom, 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 zoom. I now have dripping toilet paper. That is seriously gross. But hey, needed a blood sample. So I guess that's how I get a blood sample. Um. I'm also guessing I can't put it in the um, blood tron when it's dripping. Because that would be disgusting. And the only drier thing I've seen is in the toilet paper. In the toilet paper? I just said in the toilet paper. I meant in the bathroom. <laughs> there we go. It's I working. can dry the toilet the paper. paper is drying out. <laughs> That's hilarious. Now we have just bloody toilet paper. One sheet is enough. Okay, we can't get any more toilet paper. Oh, no, don't close the door. Right, let's go stick some stuff in the blood tron. And possibly put the photo in the other thing. It's worth a try. Might progress it a bit more. And then I have to figure out how to get the map. Okay, so use bloody toilet paper in blood tron. Booyah! Eee, it's green! Wonderful. Right, um... Right. Oh, open door. Keep doing that. Um... It's a police radio. Looks like it's on and ready to use. Ah. Okay, that's awesome. Um, <laughs> I'm glad I don't sound like a I chipmunk. I need to stay focused and solve this murder um. so I can do what I need to do. Right. Ooh, speck of dust, speck of dust. I'm getting overly excited about the speck of dust. Sweet. All right. Please don't mess with the police scanner. I'm waiting for a call about a woman in town making noise. A woman in town making noise. Huh. Five cents. Huh. Use police tron. Attention all units. It's not much, but we're short a story on page four. I'll be back <laughs> soon. Don't you touch my map. I'm totally touching the map. <laughs> I'm totally touching the map. Um, because I really need the map. That's awesome. I love these games. Right, use map on Copytron. Use shiny nickel in Copytron. What a nice copy. And in color too. Nice. I have a map. Okay, so uh, pick up map because I don't have any more thingies. And then quickly stick it back on the wall before she catches me. Perfect. Now I have a map. Woo. <laughs> I'm very happy about that. 
Okay, so I'm going to go stick the photo in the um, whatever Tron. I can't remember which Tron it is. Um, so that it's sort of prepped ready. I can't really do anything more with it until I get to the hotel. Uh, face Tron, that's what I want. Um, okay, so use photo of body in Face Tron. Bing! <laughs> So now I have a map. Oh, it's I can a look map at the map. of the county. This should help me find my way around. But I can't see the map. Can I see the map? Sadly, I think the sheriff would object to that until I've shown him the map. Okay. Right. So, anything else? Tarry cartridge, flowers. I'm sure these things will come in handy at some point. Um. Right, so I am going to go whoop, this way and then this way so I can go out of town. And yay! High five everyone, we found our way out. It only took, well, I think it was about 20 minutes bumbling around last stream um, when I decided I was going to take a break. Um, but, uh, that's not bad. It only ta it's only taken 20 minutes <laughs> in this one, too. Okay, but it means that I've opened up more of the town, which I am very happy Whoa, about. Oh, there, little agent of Reno. Well, the law of Reno is the law of Reno. No wandering around without a map. But I have a map. Hee <laughs> hee. I have an official map right here. <laughs> oh, I see. Well, uh, that looks uh, legit, Reno. Hee <laughs> Odd. Hmm. Oh, I thought I. You uh, thought you stole well, all of the maps. I well, law is tough. Law. I guess uh -huh. I'd better return all these maps to the quickie pal. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, I can go pick one up for Dolores then. Oh, yay! Part three, achievement. Fifteen G. Part three. The arrest. Sweet. I feel like we're getting close to cracking this case. The only thing you're getting close to cracking is my patience with you. Let's work together and I can get on with my... <laughs> I mean, we can get out of this town as quickly as possible. Did Agreed. you play the Hot Wheels expansion failure? We need to have a chat with the geeky programmer at the old mansion. There is something odd about her. <laughs> yeah, a woman with a brain. Definitely suspicious. <laughs> we need to talk to that crazy clown at the circus. He's got serial killer written all over him. Wouldn't it be quicker to just shoot him? We need a blood match. Using the blood tron with a blood swap from the body and Willie's blood wallet. Oh yeah, we need to get the wallet. We need a fingerprint match. Using the Fingertron with a fingerprint from the murder weapon and an official fingerprint book. Yeah, I have one of those We as well. need to identify Ooh. the body. Using the Face Tron with a photo of the body and the victim's photo ID. You mean like a driver's license or passport? Or Burger Shack loyalty card recognized around the world? <laughs> okay. Let's get cracking. <sighs> Cool, so I have a map. This is me. I'm going here. Ooh, map! Wonderful. Trailhead. Edmund Mansion Mansion. That really does say Edmund Mansion Mansion. Abandoned factory. Trailhead. Radio station. Ha! Old circus. <laughs> Bridge, Main Street. Ah, cool. Hotel. All right, I'm totally going to the hotel. Cemetery Bridge. Right. Cool. This is going to be easy. This is what I wanted. So we are currently at Vista. I'm totally going to the hotel.
I'm going to nip back and get that lady. Because they should be back at the Quickie Mart now. They're not Quickie Mart, Quickie Pal. Because the sheriff was like, oh, well, it's pointless me trying to stop them. Welcome to Quickie Pal. Ha. Can I help you find anything? Pick a map. And just sidle at the door. I totally just stole the map. <laughs> Ooh, tea time. Yeah. But um, I'm sure I would just make it and then forget it and it would go cold again. Because <clears throat> that's what I do. Unless I'm watching the TA stream because then I'm at work. Right. Hotel. Hello. Right. I'm going to be... Ah. Oh cool, it's got different colours so I don't get them mixed up. Wonderful. Okay. So, we've got a map. We took a bud swab. Perfect. Um, let's see if we can... Okay, so that's walk. No, I don't want to walk. Ooh, is that a speck of dust? Yes! Pick up speck of dust. I should check the um, achievement tracker. Ooh, I have 92% of my 25 specks of dust. I'm going to turn that on. And I'm going to stick it at the top left. There we go. Right. Most of my achievements that I'm now tracking are dust. Because apparently that's the tracking thing. Okay, so... Let's have a look. It's a revolving door. Cool. And, ooh. You're investigating here too? I wouldn't go in there if I were you. What do you mean? Why shouldn't I go in? Because you're probably superstitious and would believe all that claptrap about paranormal activity in the hotel. Paranormal? Oh. Really? That's terrible. How serious are the reports? Should I be worried? Uh, given that there's no such thing as ghosts, you'll be fine. I totally want to see the ghosts. And why are you red? Or is that just the light? What are you light? doing here? Well, Chuck's brother Franklin went missing a few weeks ago. Is he the body by the bridge? Nope. But this reporter's no says there's oh, something odd tonight. about the whole thing. I'm working up a story, but the only lead I have is someone seeing him here briefly a few weeks ago. He's he green. was seen around the lobby area. Then he just vanished. Huh. Big day today. I'm meeting some promising investors. I know they'll believe in my plan to turn the dying pillow factory into a highly profitable stuffed toy factory. It can't fail. Just gotta oh, yeah. check into a room without Chuck knowing about it. He has eyes and ears everywhere. I'll need a disguise. Also need to copy this prospectus so I can give it to the investors and keep my copy. Okay. Chuck wouldn't know a good idea if it hit him. Stuffed toys of the future. What luck finding some investors. Better get ready for them. Right, so this is Dolores's dad, Franklin. We met Dolores in the previous flashback when she wanted to be a programmer and work for what is effectively LucasArts, but it was called Mucus something or other. Um, so this is her dad. He's Chuck's brother. Chuck died, I think, recently. Um, but that... Those teddy bears. I swear the dead guy at the beginning had a teddy bear. Maybe... The dead guy was either the investors, the investor, or was it not enough him time to leave the hotel area? Disguise? Too much to get done before the investors arrive. What? I thought you wanted to have a disguise. Okay, fine. Let's go in. Okay. There is a really weird fountain. Words don't do it justice. Yeah, they really don't. There's a shouting person and I I I could I, be headless gold panning. I have no idea what they're doing. Yeah. That's a 
Nicht? It looks better from this side. There are some coins at the bottom. What a waste of money. I don't want to pick that up. I don't think that water is clean. But I want to get the... Fine. So. Edmund Hotel. It's still showing December 1986. <laughs> I guess they couldn't afford a new one for 1987. Ooh, computer. Which is just fuzzy. Wonderful. Okay. Ooh, blah. It's been lipstick to death. I don't feel like cleaning up after hotel guests right now. Yo, dude. Huh. What's that jacket you're wearing? The latest and greatest jacket. It zips in the front. Don't most jackets do that? <sighs> you're too old to understand. What's on your face? They're the latest and greatest nose glasses from the Jason the News Guy adventure game from Mucus Flem Games. With these on, no one knows who I am. Jason the news guy. Okay. What's on your feet? The latest and greatest Reeboks. I just got them. Aren't they rad? <laughs> What's with all the latest and greatest? I'm not grody like you. Everyone knows that unless you got the latest and greatest, you might as well barf. <laughs> I'm not risking my reputation by touching anything that's not like the latest and greatest. What if I said you didn't have the latest and greatest stuff? <laughs> like, barf me out. All my stuff is totally the latest and the greatest. Your glasses are not the latest and greatest. These glasses have got to be the latest and greatest, aren't they? Did something newer come out? <laughs> nah, you're wigging. I can't trust a dweeb like you. Your jacket is not the latest and greatest. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm so sure. Your shoes are not the latest and greatest. What's your damage? Of course! They're totally awesome! I would totally know what was the latest and greatest. Oh yeah? I bet you don't know anything about what's the greatest right now in 1987. Prove you're not just an old dweeb from the 50s. Sure, I can prove it. I'm totally bodacious because I can talk like you and... <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Oh, okay, so... 1987. Gnarly? Fly? Peeps? Groovy? Hmm. Gnarly sounds like something Bill and Ted would say. And they're sort of that era, aren't they? Note my cool hipness. I was six in 1987, so forgive me for not knowing. Um, well, we'll just try I and know see this happens. gnarly dude who... Ah, MTV. Was on MTV and... Okay, no, no way ever you doing YOLO. Uh... Ooh, that just sounds really old. And um, hip daddy -o sounds more 70. Tells me what's wicked and what'll gag me with a spoon. Whoa! You're legit! Ha! I totally believe you know what's tight right now. Oh, yeah. You've got something new and sick. I'll trade you. Until then, I'm gonna rock out. Ah, oh, don't you just love this music? Okay, maybe I didn't. Oh, okay. Right. Oh, he did believe me. Okay. 
but I've just got to find something new and sick. That's not very good. Um, and then trade him. I'm not thirsty. Oh, I can. and an event space area. The doors are closed. It's locked. Oh. I don't feel like cleaning up after all. Yes, right now. Ooh. Um, let's just try going up. That's Ooh. weird. I swear I pushed the penthouse button. Must be broken. Four six. Okay. An ashtray for the smokers. The view ain't bad from up here. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Okay, cool. Well, I'm um, just looking at locked doors and then I will um, head back down and talk to the kid again. I did manage to get him to trust me, but um, then um, I, I'm not quite sure what I need to... I have no idea what M is. Um, oh, M is there. Okay, fair enough. All right, I'm gonna go talk. I wonder if my prototype pillow bear would be uh, appropriately. Uh... Hello. Hi. Hello, Hello Sedulous. Guess he can't Sed hear me. Sedulous. Greatest for me, I don't have the time for you. Said you oh, don't okay, you just you. Love cool. this music? All right, okay, so I'm gonna try, I, I, I'm gonna try again. Love Want this bear? Mm, I guess you can't hear me. Ah, keep the boombox. Hey, dude, what's your damage? Give prototype bit of bear. Dude, check out this rad new pillow bear. It's righteous. Big time righteous. I'll do you a favor and trade you. You'd do that for me? Ha! Ah, <laughs> that works. Well, what do you want to trade? Um. Trade for the I'll glasses. I'll trade you the bear for your glasses. No faking. Gag me. Your glasses totally make you look like a dweeb. No, duh. Eh, take the glasses then. Quick, before anyone notices I have them. First, <laughs> here's my used gum for your collection. Uh, I don't have a gum collection. Uh, never mind that. Now give me that bear so I rock it out. Sure, or dweeb dude, or gnarlicious, or... <laughs> I can't keep this up. Let's get this over with. Here this it is. is so painful. Sweet! Your ace. Later, dude. Okay, so now I have gum. Ew, I have sticky gum. And glasses. Okay. Alright, I'm going to use the glasses. Nobody Woo! can recognize disguise. me now with this foolproof disguise. To-do list. Disguise appearance. Woohoo. Right. Can I pick up the boombox? Because I like picking up things. It only plays that one song, and I've already heard enough okay. of that. Right. So. A bell for calling the sheriff. I mean, hotel manager. <laughs> the sheriff. The hotel manager. The coroner. 
Welcome to the Edmond Hotel, most beautiful hotel abu in the Tri Thimbleweed Park County area. How may I be a boo of service? Okay, I'm gonna have to read that on my screen. Okay. Sergulos means of a person in action showing dedication and diligence. My name is Luis. Oh, that's my middle name. My middle name is Luis. Cool. Right. Okay, cool. Uh, ooh. Do you have photocopying here? But of course we do, Abu. Abu, Abu, Abu. Abu, Abu. That is to say we normally do, but uh, we've run out of paper, Abu. Unless I get more paper, Abu, I won't be able to help you out. Abu. <laughs> I'd like okay. to check in. Okay, sir. What's your name, Abu, for the booking? Oh, yeah. Um... from Twin Peaks. Robert Palmer. <laughs> of course, Mr. Palmer. We have a lovely suite abu for you Poor on the Palmer, 11th floor. It? Your suite Twin has Peaks. been fitted with the new state of the art abu Hotel Tron 3000. It's the such new technology abu that we're still fitting out the rooms on the 10th floor. How else may I be abu of service? Is there any surveillance in the hotel? No, certainly not, Mr. Palmer. Whoa, we have our state-of-the-art Abu Hotel Tron 3000 system, which creates a VHS video of your entire stay with us. Sounds like surveillance to me. How much, you ask? For just $19.99, you get a unique record of your trip highlights to share with friends Abu back home. It's such a new system that we're still installing it on the 10th Abu floor. Since you won't want to miss a second of your amazing Abu stay here, we recommend that guests do not visit the 10th floor. Okay, I totally want to visit the 10th floor. I'm going to look at my, I mean, your beautiful lobby. Goodbye. Have a nice evening, Abu. Okay. All right. Totally want... Oop, wrong way. Totally want to... Um... visit the 10th floor because I have just been told that I shouldn't visit the 10th floor so I totally want to visit the 10th floor but the penthouse gave me the 6th floor apparently I can visit the 10th floor though okay cool right ooh it's an unplugged TV can I pick up the TV nope I got Oops. I don't want to pick that up. Okay. It's a photo of a perfectly clean standard room. It's a photo of a perfectly clean deluxe room. It says that contractors should use these photos to set up rooms correctly, so the Hotel Tron can determine when a room isn't clean. Nice. That's kind of handy. What an amazing view. Ooh. Hello, room. Looks fine to me. Mm. Try using the light switch in on the tea. <laughs> where's it gone? Oh yeah. Ooh. Right, where's the other light? There's the light switch, okay. Use light switch. Hello. Alright. Ooh, phone book. Ha. <laughs> Yeah, they're the numbers I tried ringing before. Um, but I honestly. An unmade bed. Want to. Uh... Ooh, stationery. It's hotel stationery. That is, it's a mostly blank piece of paper. Perfect. I'm just going to turn on all the lights, because why not? It's turned off. This channel is just static. I should find another channel. I can't push that. It's now showing I love my cat. I am happy with that. <laughs> and if I go to sleep, I'll never finish my to-do list. 
Mine is kind of embarrassing. It's totally based off the um, looks like the other painting television show Angel, and then the initials of the guy that I had a crush on. Who's the fairest of them all? I, I made up my first email address. <laughs> <laughs> it's just sort of stuck. <laughs> yes, it's toilet paper, also known as toilet mm. tissue. I don't want that. That is the history of my The lid of a toilet? Things don't get more amazing than that. Okay, I've turned everything on. Now I'm going to go into a different room and also turn everything on because this amuses me. And also, it's a good way to get paper. Stationary. Uh, this channel is just static. I should find another. Ch it's now showing. I love my cat. Okay, but we've already seen that one. It's now showing banana, banana, bananas. Banana, banana, bananas. Sweet. Looks like the other painting. I'm assuming because this floor isn't set up with the surveillancey thing that I could just walk into any room. Other than that, I'd probably have to use my key card. Oh, I I'm on floor 11. Okay. So, I'm not the guy at the beginning because he was in 604, I believe. This channel is just static. I should find another channel. It's now showing I love my cat. It's now showing banana, banana, bananas. It's now showing skiing for cash. Skiing for cash, okay. Cool. Kind of a catchy song now. I am a terrible, terrible person wasting all the electricity. And I have four sheets of paper. This channel is just static. I should find enough. It's now showing I love my cat. It's now showing banana, banana, banana bananas. It's now showing skiing for cash. It's now showing, it's now showing the rich and the soapy. <laughs> Okay, I gotta see where the channels are. It's now showing hospital hijinks. Mm. I turned it off. Okay. Okay. TV doesn't work. Ooh. Ah. Sweet. More paper. I wonder how many sheets I need. It's my precious, dazzling four-page prospectus about oh. turning the pillow factory into a toy factory. I only have the original. I need a copy to give to the investors. How many copies do I need? I got kind of bored of turning everything on now. Oh, I guess I can get two copies of everything. Pick up a stationery. I have eight sheets of paper now. Ooh, there's another room. Pick up paper. All right, I have nine sheets of paper. I guess I have one sheet just in case. The doors are closed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Push the button. Push the button. Da, da, da. All right, so floor 11. So I can go to my room. Which is 11.05. Ah, you see, yeah, all the other doors are locked. So, use keycard. Ooh! Ooh! If 
phone's ringing. Hello? Yes, only on Tuesdays. Yes, I'm almost ready for our meeting. I've just got to wrap up a couple more things. I'll call you back when I'm ready. Cool. What's that monstrosity? A Hoteltron. Chuck must have had them installed recently. I'll have to find a way to stop it recording my meeting. And I still need to get a copy of my amazing prospectus. Then I can keep the original for myself and give a copy to the investors. So, to do lists. Get more photocopy paper. Pick up. Dictionary. Woo! <laughs> Seriously? It's not ticked off yet? Okay, so. It's a camera that appears to be filming the room constantly. Chuck's eyes are everywhere. I don't oh, know how oh, people put oh, up with it. Oh. Use gum with Tron. Ha! Totally. Right, so it can't see you now. It's a camera that appears to be filming the room constantly. Chuck's eyes are everywhere. Mm, looks fine to me. This channel is just static. I should find another channel. It's now showing I love my cat. Guys. Back to being plain old oh. Franklin. Well, Nobody can recognize me now with this foolproof. <laughs> How long have I been playing this? Um, I played it for three and a half hours, I think. Um, uh, uh, the weekend, and then uh, fifty-three minutes. Um. Welcome back to the Edmund Hotel, so Mr. Palmer. Four and a bit hours. <laughs> How may I be a boo of service? I can't save on anything. Okay. I have some stationery. Could you use this as photocopying paper? That should be all the paper, Abu, I need. What would you like to photocopy? This prospectus document. <laughs> sure thing, Abu. I really wanted That's to say I want to copy I the toys, I'll but. <laughs> One task done. Now I should go to my room and prepare. Okay. So I have copy, but I still have all this paper. Can I can I copy the toys Welcome book? Welcome back to the Edmund Hotel, Mr. Palmer. How may I be a boo of service? Oh. Fine. I'm going to Can't look at my I mean your toys, beautiful <laughs> lobby. Goodbye. Should have tried that have first. <laughs> Okay, so time. Evening, Abu. So I have been playing for four hours and eighteen minutes, apparently. Right. Okay, so um, what's my to-do list say? Uh, disable surveillance camera. I thought I had. Call investors when. Use the paper. Don't know. Okay. Ooh. No. Can't use. Can use the computer. I'm not using that. Okay. Chuck's probably monitoring every keystroke. Back up to my room. 
use Kit Kat. Oh, my word. What is it? Aha! Hmm, that's not right. It's gone blank. Ha! There seems to be a little problem, Abu, with your hotel truck. There we go, sir, Abu. Huh, some blank paper got stuck mm. here accidentally, Abu. I'll dispose, Abu, of this for you. No need to say thank you. We're here to help. Okay, all right. I could do with both a hug and a nap right now, but I've got to get ready for my meeting. Damn. Right, okay. Um. Oh. What did I do? Are you happy now? I've done everything you asked. Okay, that's not creepy at all. Where I pushed the penthouse button must be broken. Okay. Doesn't want me to go to the penthouse. There don't seem to be any stairs either. Nine rooms on each floor. And only the tenth floor was open. Okay. Interesting. I've got an achievement that says Hotel Tourist. I want to see what it is. Visit every floor in the hotel. Okay, I can do that. <sighs> okay, I'm wanting that while we're thinking. Visited six, seven. I'd love to get to the penthouse. I don't know um, how one would do it. Because it doesn't seem to, to let me. I'm assuming there's a reason for that, in that, you know, it's like hard coded or something. You have to have maybe a, a special. Key card or button or something. Um, twelve. Okay. Twelve. And achievement unlocked. Woohoo! Uh, thirty-five tourist hotel tourists visit every floor. And also new follower. Hello Jason. Welcome to my currently possibly boring stream because I'm trying to figure out how to disable a camera. <laughs> um, 
Oh, and they're gone. Oh, hi Keith! I can see you there. Uh, right. To do list. Disable surveillance camera. Well, let's try piece of paper one more time. Hmm, that's not right. It's gone blank. There seems to be a little problem, Abu, with your whole okay. drawing. There we go, sir, Abu. Huh, some blank paper got stuck hmm. here accidentally, Abu. Sir, Abu. Now dispose, Abu, of this for you. No need to say thank you. We're here to help. Well, oh, no, paper. The Hotel Tron 3000 seems to think this bed is made. And if I go to sleep, I'll never <laughs> finish my to-do list. I don't want that. Ah, oh, hang on. Can pick up the mirror? I don't want to pick that Aww, up. Aww, that would have been cool. Can I push it? I can't push that. Okay. If there's the paper on it, then the dude comes back and... I don't want to pick that up. It's getting dark out there now. Yeah. Okay. Any ideas? Any ideas? Go for another explore. Can't visit the penthouse. Let's go back down to the lobby. Of course, had to put me on the eleventh floor. Yes, that moment when nothing seems to work. Yes, I get that a lot in these types of games. Um, it happened in the last stream, and I sort of um, figured, kind of figured it out after thinking about it. But it's tricky. How? Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I have just had a, a brainwave. Would you like to know what my brainwave is? I was just thinking that on the tent floor, it had those pictures that the hotel tron was supposed to look at to see if the room's clean. So if I put the picture on it, stuck, it's not going to go blank. It is certainly worth a try, isn't it? So, pick up. Yes! Ha ha! Oops. And it, let me pick up. There we go. Okay, so. It's a photo of a clean standard hotel room. It's a photo of a clean deluxe hotel room. Cool. I'm not quite sure which one I'm supposed to have, but I figure if I pick them both up, then um, I don't have to come back down again. Right. Ah, sudden brainwave. And I was like, what have I seen? Because obviously I can't put blank paper on it. Right. So, use key card in door. Oops. I totally just didn't do that. Use key card. So, I think that sort of looks. Okay, so you standard. There we go. Waiting. What was that? I guess it was nothing. Looks like the Tron machines are working perfectly. Yay! Totally no nailed it. Perfect. Now Chuck will have no idea what I do in my meeting. I'm finally ready for that meeting. 
better give the investors a call to let them know they can come up. Sweet. All right. So, use phone. You can come up to my room now. I'm ready. So, is this where we discover that plain old Franklin? Who the investor is. That was quick. Uh, oh, it's you. How did you know I was here? Uh oh. Franklin Thanks, was Sam. never seen again. I had a brainwave. <laughs> um, I asked okay, the sheriff so... for more information, but there was nothing. No body, no Franklin. Some huh. of the more superstitious types claim he's haunting this hotel. But those of us dedicated to fact-finding know that must be poppycock. That's an interesting Ooh, story. Achievement. 15. Secret meeting. Completed Franklin's flashback. Sweet. So Franklin's dead as well? No one knows for sure if he's dead. Isn't it a great time to be a journalist in Thimbleweed oh. Park? One missing, Is... a mystery body, and Chuck died of a heart attack. Did you find out the identity of the body in the river yet? No. I'm not telling the um, what we have maybe and Chuck found out killed yet. Franklin and then have pretended that way. Franklin was Chuck. Possibly but you didn't some kind of weird identity question. thing. Why are you here? I see. I can't fool you. If you ever want to switch professions, we need reporters like you. That still doesn't answer my question about why, why you're here. Red. Okay, okay. I was following up on a report that Franklin checked in here under a pseudonym. Finally. A pseudonym? What was it? All I could find out is that a man with a large nose was seen around the same time as Franklin. And? That man checked in under the name Robert Palmer. So it may not have been Chuck's brother. <laughs> what room did the man with the large nose Love check into? It was a room on the 11th floor. I couldn't find out anything more without a shiny official badge like you have. Cool. I wish the door would stop spinning. Why is it so hard to get <laughs> It's making me a bit dizzy. You. Let's call it a job interview. <sighs> As I've said, I need good reporters so I don't have to run all over the county. I don't have time to be a newspaper reporter. Fair enough, but you know where to find me. What's new in the news? Uh, just a bunch of reports about paranormal activity here at the hotel. I don't give them much credence. I totally want to see a ghost. Thanks for all the information. See you later. If you find out anything publishable, stop by the nickel to let me know. Will do. Right. Ooh, I have new thingies. Find out what happened to Franklin. Cool. Okay. All right. So let's look at the hideous mountain. Hmm. There are some coins at the bottom. What <laughs> a waste of money. I have no idea what they are doing. Can I? and steal some coins. I can't put it in there. Okay, no. That totally didn't work. Right. Could be a headless gold panning. Words don't do it justice. Hmm. It looks better from this side. Mm -hmm. right, so let us have a wonder over here. God, they've still not cleaned up that glass. It's been lipsticked to death. I don't feel like cleaning up after hotel guests right now. <laughs> they couldn't think of any new dialogue. Oh dear. Yeah, okay, computer doesn't work. It's still showing December 1986. I guess they couldn't afford a new one for 1987. Welcome to the Edmund Hotel. Most beautiful hotel abu in the tri Dimbleweed Park County. Hi, Radical. I can I can see you there. Thank you for dropping by. You look awfully familiar. Have we met before? I don't believe abu so. Well, there you go. Abu. Is oh, anything dear. going on in the hotel today? Nothing, abu. Certainly not more cases of food poisoning. <laughs> Definitely not abu. Is anything going on in the hotel today? Nothing, Abu. Certainly not more cases of food poisoning. <laughs> Definitely not, Abu. That's cool. I am um, you know in to a hotel and, Edmund? and hopefully going to ah, see a ghost. I saw which him, be cool. but I don't know, Abu, what happened to him. Funny thing, Abu, though. 
Go on. That same day, a man with a large nose abu checked in and then disappeared. <laughs> you don't say. That is an odd arena coincidence. Hmm. What room did he check into? Oh, let me see Abu now. Never it was a Mr. Robert Palmer. Yes. He checked into a room, Abu, on the 11th floor. I'd like that room key for our investigation. Sweet. So I'm not sure I should do that without a warrant, Abu. Uh-uh. But since there's nothing to see there, I suppose, Abu, I can give it to you. Yay. Thank you. Finally. How Ooh. else may I be Abu of service? I have two room keys. I'm going to check out your beautiful lobby. Goodbye. Cool. Have a nice evening, Abu. Ah. <laughs> okay, that's just weird. All right, upstairs. Is it still locked? It's locked. Okay. Elevator. Right. Ooh, speck of dust, speck of dust. Sweet. Right. Let us have a look on every floor. Because there may be more specks of dust. And that's always fun. Okay. I honestly probably could have done this when I was doing the other achievement, or waited till I was doing the other achievement, but hey, I missed some in flashbacks earlier, so um, I figure better safe than sorry. Um, it's quite possible there's no specks of dust on these floors. But I like to be thorough. I'm going to have to play this through twice anyway. Um, apparently the difficulties don't stack. Um, and you have to do a playthrough picking up 75 specks of dust. And a playthrough picking up no specks of dust. So you've got to do two playthroughs anyway. Right. Hockey dogs. So... Um ba 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 oh hang on what room was the other guy in? Uh six oh seven. It's not too bad. I mean once you've done it and you know all the solutions, I suppose it won't take that long to replay. Ooh there is a light on. Okay, so I'm gonna put the switch on first because there we go. Right. Passport pick up passport. Beautiful. It's a German passport for Boris Schultz. Boris Schultz. There we go. Pick up bear. The label says pillow bear. The toy that can be turned into a pillow. That's very cool. Chuck's reach extends everywhere in this town. Even from his grave. Yeah. It's really creepy. Okay. There's nothing in here that I can see. Except for the um, pillow bear. The doors are closed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just waiting for the button. Um, so we know who it is. It's Boris Schultz. So we should be able to get a report from the thingy magic. Let's just zip up to 11. Yeah, yeah. Um, the easy playthrough, I think, has less puzzles. Um, so, as long as you don't accidentally pick up the dust, um, you should be okay. Right, so this is the room where he died. TV's not on. That's where I left the TV and the radio on. The lights are on. Okay, pick up gum. Because you never know when I'm that not might be used. Touching that. Oh, okay, fine. There's nothing in here then. 
<laughs> the Hotel Tron 3000 seems to think this bed is made. The photo's gone off the Hotel Tron. It's turned off. This channel is just static. I should find another channel. It's now showing I love my cat. Hmm. It's now showing banana banana bananas. It's now showing skiing for cash. Huh, it's now showing the rich and the soapy. It's now showing hospital hijinks. <laughs> I turned it off. <laughs> yes, um, yeah, radical. Um, this guy is not particularly adventurous. Um, and he is a, in a point and click game. However, he also appears to have an ulterior motive because in the notepad. Uh, it says, Ray, who's the other agent, is starting to get on my nerves. Hopefully she stays focused on the case and lets me do what I need to. Which sounds really um, dodgy. Like, this is a perfect cover. No one should have been assigned, may pose some problems. So this guy is dodgy. Um... Yeah, um, we also want to find out what happened to the fire. So we now have an ID. So we can get one report. And then if we switch to the other person... Oh, we can't switch to the other person. Why can't I switch to Dolores? Uh, not Dolores, um, Ray's. Oh, it's weird. Okay. So, the photo's gone. Ooh, 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 spooky! Hey, Franklin. What was all that about? Why couldn't they see me? Oh. I'm dead? Hmm. Well, I guess that's probably what I deserve. Oh. About time ooh, ooh, you ooh. joined us in the land of the almost dead. Who are you? I'm Xavier, the head ghost, and I'm in charge of the ghosts. I run a tight ship. Everyone must pull their weight or face the penalty. <laughs> what do you mean, pull their yes, weight? Yes, that's the mom. Don't ask. Time to update the schedule for everyone to follow. Clara, you're on elevator duty. Don't let anyone get to the penthouse. Ah. I was just on elevator duty. No arguing. Now, Virgil, keep up the good work on front door duty. Oh, that's why it's Don't spinning. let anyone in or out of the hotel. It's about time the living started realizing who's really in charge around here. That doesn't seem right. That's yeah. irrelevant. New ghost, okay. you're going to scare at least two people who try to use the drinking fountain in the lobby. Okay? <laughs> Where's LeChuck? Yeah, that's a good work. point, Felia. What are you Where is for, Ghost LeChuck? That would be really cool if I had a cameo in By this. By the way, your brother died. Chuck's dead? Oh, when did okay. that happen? So there I'm wasn't a body switch. Tyranny. That is, I know he would have come here to tell me off if he could. I wonder why this head ghost seems so bossy. I've got to scare someone? Hmm. Maybe I have special powers. Ooh. Maybe I get to be a ghost. Yeah, I get to be a ghost. Sweet. It's a door. That tickles. Also surprisingly <laughs> easy. Okay, so we don't have a Luchuk, but his brother is called Chuck, so it's probably, um... Yeah, okay, so the ghost has a to-do list. That's kind of cool. Ooh. I wonder if we can go into the other rooms. Ah! We can go into the other rooms. Cool, alright. Can we? The elevator isn't on this floor. An electrical elevator button. Maybe I've got some useful special power I can use here. Zap. Elevator. Sweet. Can I Ooh. wail? <laughs> In the moon. Ah, hello. You to Clara. are doing your job. Scaring someone in the lobby instead of talking to me. You don't want to make Xavier mad. Okay, so zap. Elevator buttons. 
I want to go to the penthouse. Sorry, but Xavier said no one could go to the penthouse. All faces. Right, let's go down to the lobby then. Ooh! Hey, Jeff. Thank you for following. I am currently a ghost. It is very cool. Um, so here we are. Right. Ooh, drinking fountain. Annoying kid. Splash drinking fountain. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> <Get real. laughs> That's totally not the greatest. What's going on here, Abu? I better jet out of here. No, oh, it's just the drinking Abu fountain. <laughs> as long as it's not something serious, Abu, then I won't have to call our plumbers. Not bad. Now cool. you need to find someone else to scare. Then you'll have met your daily quota. I have to get back to work now. How long are you on door duty for? Until Xavier says we're all done for the day. Now, deep breath. Okay, so... What? Why can't I leave? I bet it's Xavier keeping me here in this stupid hotel. Okay. Ha! <laughs> you have a special power, you make bear disappear. That's cool. Um... Ah, that's boring. Ooh, ballroom. I wonder if I can get into the the ballroom. It's chaos in there. I think they're setting up for something. Oh, until they're that's done boring. setting up before I go in. Fair enough. Hmm. Okay. So I can't get out yet. Oops. Uh. The effect would be better if someone was using it. Ha! The effect would be better if someone was using it. Oh, okay, fine. I need right. to stay focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. Well, in which case... Uh, right. In which case... Ah, oh, balls. Too slow. Um, I still can't get to the penthouse yet. And I also can't be Dolores. Not Dolores. I keep on calling her Dolores. Race. Ray, race. They're both called Ray. It's really annoying. Lady. Yeah, because I can't switch and be the lady. Okay, so. If I use the drinking fountain, oh, I can't switch. Okay. Ah. ah, there we go. Cool. Happen? Something spooky is going on. <laughs> What's going on here, Abu? The drinking fountain? It's, um... Oh, it's just the fountain, Abu, again? It still doesn't seem serious enough to call the plumbers, Abu. Passable. I'm surprised you had it in you. <laughs> Time for another ghost meeting. Clara, oh. Virgil, get over here now. <laughs> I didn't talk to Virgil. Virgil. Good work on the door. That should do it for today. New ghost. Average first scares. You keep practicing. Clara, stay on elevator duty. I need some privacy. This is yeah. outrageously unfair. Why do the men get to finish for the day? Enough complaining. Do you remember what happened last time? Hmm. All right, all right. Sorry about him. We don't know who put him in charge. No. Interesting. It's an elevator. I wonder what the, the elevator isn't responding. Someone must have locked its use. Oh. Okay. Can I get? Ooh, hang on. What's going on in the computer? Uh. Damn it! I swear he was using it. 
Help! I'm a ghost! Ah, room 705. Has someone in. Okay. Interesting. Go. Oh, still room 705. So someone's in room 705, but the the elevator's locked. It's a button to call the elevator. Ah, didn't hit the button. Right, okay. Well, back to work, Abu. Hmm. It's an elevator. Xavier says talking on duty is not allowed. Also, I don't talk to new ghosts. Mm. Leave me alone. Okay, fine. Seven oh five. I can't get out. Oh, oh! I can get out of the hotel now. Damn it! All right. Well, I'm gonna scare the dude in seven oh five because that just seems funny to me. Someone is using this bed in an attempt to relax. Oh. Ooh. I'll never get to finish that delicious sandwich. I wonder when he'll show up. Hmm. When who will show up? Okay. Fine. How's the serenity? Okay. Right. Let's try and go out. Oops. Let's try and go out of the um, hotel now. It's an elevator. Because um, Virgil or whatever his name is was not on the door anymore. I mean, it's possible I won't be able to get out, but it's worth a try. What? Why can't ah, I balls. I bet okay. it's Xavier keeping me here in this stupid hotel. <sighs> okay, so. Can't talk to Dolores, can't talk to Tim. Get into the penthouse. Sorry, but Xavier said no one could go to the penthouse. I don't have... Sorry, but Xavier said no one could go to the penthouse. Hello, I can now be Dolores. Can I go in? Oh, hang on, is there a dust thing over here? We need one more dust thing to achieve. To achieve. Um, yeah, I thought I could only control the ghost, but apparently I can... Um, I wonder what the guest is up to now. Ooh, dust, dust, dust! And... Achievement? Yay! Achievement! 25G Dust Appreciator. Collect 25 specks of dust. I wonder what the guest is up to now. Welcome to the Edmund Hotel. Mm. Most beautiful hotel abu in the Tri-Thimbleweed Park County area. How may I be a boo of service? Hello, Sheriff. Why are you moonlighting as the hotel manager? No, oh, Abu. Uh, I'm not the sheriff. I'm the hotel manager. <laughs> uh, the sheriff says that annoying Areno thing all the time. You'll never hear me doing that, Abu. Sure. Whatever. Is anything <sighs> going on in the hotel today? Nothing, Abu. Certainly not more cases of uh, food poisoning. 
Definitely. I'm going to check out your... Goodbye. Have a nice evening, Abu. Hmm. Right. Okay, so. I can now be everybody. And I... Hang on. Blue was never my favorite color. Can I go down? Let's see what the achievement tracker is trying to tell me. Got one called Mean Person. Make everybody cry about their life, and I've got 20% of it. Blue was never my favorite color. No, it's not gonna work. Oh. Who's giving me an evil stare? He. <laughs> I don't know what I mean when I say, you know. Aww. Mm. You know, I I don't know what okay. I mean when I say, you know. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Okay, so those can't go out, but we can. So let us head to the circus. Because honestly, I'm a little confused like at what you need to do. So maybe I'll go and pick some other things up. Tickets, 25 cents. Okay. Aww. That was interesting. I walked on the road and then uh, Open up. Uh, Federal agents. Keep your panties on. I'm coming. Ah, ransom. Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying. So hey, take ransom. your dime store suit and good news pamphlets and stick them where the sun don't shine. Ransom the clown? I heard you know about a body by the bridge. Gee, yeah. no foreplay, Red? You don't beat around the bush, do you? Not my style. You can ask your questions, Toots, but I'm not saying I'll answer. Okay. What do you know about the body by the river? What body? Earlier this evening, we found a body down by the bridge. We're investigating, and I was told you might have some information for me. Nah, I heard some sirens before, but I figured they were headed for the mansion mansion. That's where most of the f***ed up stuff happens. Mansion, mansion. What weird stuff do you know about at the mansion? You want to find out about the mansion mansion? You're going to have to talk to some other idiot. I keep to <laughs> myself and the town folk leave me the f*** alone. Thank you. I'm not about to rock the boat. I don't pay rent here and I can't go anywhere else after my f***ing ex-wife took me for everything I had. <laughs> That's right. We heard you don't get along with the locals. Given my creepy clown face, and Paul Jean for abusive name calling, it's not made me a popular community figure. No. But I don't need the validation of these small town losers. I'm Ransom the don't. Clown. I was on the Tonight Show. I'm great. <laughs> you like beeping. What do you know about Chuck? Chuck? As in Chuck, my factory is too good to make toys, Edmund? Didn't know the pompous well myself, but I knew his brother Franklin. Weedy guy. Total scared to stand up to his big brother, even though the family business was in the crapper. How do you know Franklin Edmund? We were supposed to go into business together. My act was about to go bigger than Jesus. I was a hit on the Tonight Show. I was on my way to the top, so we figured why not cash in with a little merchandising. 
Franklin wanted to get the pillow factory into making toys, so it seemed like a good fit. What kind of toys were you planning to make with Franklin? Jeez, how do you get by in life without brains or beauty? Isn't it obvious? We were gonna make Ransom the Clown insult dolls. Would have been great if Franklin hadn't bailed on me and gone missing before we signed the contracts. I could have been rich by now if that little toady had grown a backbone. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back. Whatever, Red. I'll be back. Not like I'm going anywhere, but you're not getting inside without a warrant. Okay. Radio station. Speck dust. It says Phone Tron three thousand for when you need to handle hundreds of phone calls. Hmm. Mm. No way oh. am I climbing that. I'm afraid of heights. Oh. Okay then. Let's go inside. The feds are watching us. <laughs> Make no mistake about it. The only way to protect yourself is to fight back. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. We are totally ridiculous. Totally watching. Interesting playlist. Tuna Head by Razor and the Scumettes. Then Tuna Head by Razor and the Scumettes. Followed by Tuna Head by Razor and the Scumettes. And featuring Tuna Head by Razor and the Scumettes. It's a music poster. What a big lever. Pull the lever! What a big lever. It's locked and bolted from... It's a turntable. Who's the lever? What a big lever. It's a record. Impressive mic. I'm not showing my badge here. Okay, fine. It's locked and bolted from the inside. Okay, fine. We can't go in here yet. <sighs> Map. Let's see what else we've got. Abandoned factory. Trailhead. Edmund Mansion Mansion. Okay, abandoned factory. This looks very much like um, Monkey Island. When it does the little map thing, I remember that animation from there. For clothes, by order of Safely First Savings. And in small print. For inquiries, contact Safely First Savings, probate executor of this property. Hmm. Looks dangerous. The future used to be a wonderful thing. Hmm. It's a locked gate. Hmm. Okay, let me talk to Ransom. It's locked. Fine. Okay. Trailhead. Speck of dust. Oh, pizza person. Why is there a pizza person? It's a puddle full of muddy water. Okay, it's just a puddle. Ooh. I 
wonder if we can get lost in the woods. Ooh, thimble berries. Damn, ouch, beep, crap, ow. Whoa! Ah. The thorns on that bush are razor sharp. That's disgusting. Ah. Apparently, it's really easy to get lost in the woods. Okay, so last thing mansion. Woohoo! I can't open that. It's a very strange mailbox with a big tube on top. Oh. Can we pick up some wood? No, thanks. You think I'm a log lady? Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, but I got a gas can though. Hello, how can I help you? Federal agent. What do you know about the body by the river? I'm sorry, this isn't a good time to chat. So if you'll excuse me, I need to talk to my sister about the will reading before heading out. She's waiting for me in the library. Well, okay. Just don't leave town. I need to stay f Oh, hey, I can be ransom. I'm Dolores. Oh, sweet. Hmm. <laughs> 47 more specs of test. <laughs> Always time to do laundry later. Ew. 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 It's gross. I'll just leave it where it is. That way I can laugh at the sheriff whenever I feel like crap. It's an attempted delivery notice. It's a stack of eviction notices. <laughs> like that sheriff is really gonna drag me to court. I scare the crap out of him. That slop tasted like crap when I made it last week. No thanks. Better leave it where it is. My old circus poster featured the amazing Ransom the Clown. It's a page from my joke book. It's my joke book, but there are four pages missing. I don't want to pick that up. That's not what I meant to do. Pick up page. Come back here. Hey. Oh no. Stop. Oh dear. Page went away. Damn broken window. <laughs> All right, use page. Got the page joke stuck book. back into the joke book. Use page. Got the page stuck back into the joke book. Use page. Got the page joke stuck book. back into the joke book. Okay. Aww. I 
almost feel sorry for him. I glued him to the table so no one could steal him back when I almost. thought they were real. No, I don't like to make my bed. Who the f cares? Looks like a f rat hole. It's a rat hole. That's gross. I'm not surprised though. I mean, seriously, it's disgusting in here. I need to be higher to jump on it. This is depressing. Okay. It's a rancid kernel of popcorn. Little Beeper loves this crap. I won't pick up some greasy, disgusting, inedible piece of popcorn if I can't put it in something. Okay. I can't you leave are. the circus till I feed Little Beeper. Who the hell is Little Beepers? Looks like a rat hole. Oh, speck of dust. Woohoo! Ah, oh, sleep tight. I'm probably gonna stream for another half an hour. Or when I get stuck, basically. Um, but thank you for watching, I really appreciate it. It's uh, so much more fun when you're actually uh, streaming to people. Looks like a brat hole! Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Use moldy cheese on hull. Aha! I won't pick up some greasy, disgusting, inedible piece of popcorn if I can't put it in something. Okay, now there is moldy cheese on the floor and I can't do anything about it. Package held at Thimbleweed Park Post Office for Ransom the Clown. I'm not gonna search the circus for you, Ransom. George the Postman. No. Oh, you, George. I can't get there from here. There's another way. Fine. <sighs> Unsure what is speck of dust and what is popcorn, but let's head over here see if we can get something to put the popcorn in. That's where the midway used to be. Now it's my garbage dump. That's where the midway used to be. Now it's my garbage okay. dump. I can't get back in the trailer. Oh, hang on, I need to open the door. Yes. Um No thanks. Better leave it where it is. Ah, comic book. Oh This is on comic That's book. A rare first edition of my fantastic comic book. Still can't get the makeup off. Well, it's good. At least I've tried. <laughs> Always time to do laundry later. Hmm. Oh, 
popcorn, popcorn. Ooh, speck of dust. It's empty. The rats and I cleaned it out years ago. I don't want to pick that up. Boop. That's what that's what the midway used to be. Now it's my garbage dump. It's a rancid kernel of popcorn. Little beeper loves it. I won't pick up some greasy, disgusting, inedible piece of popcorn if I can't put it in something. Where am I supposed to put it? That's a huge pile of slimy rancid yeah. popcorn. Hmm. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. There's something. Looks like a rat hole. No. And circus grounds. Ah, there we are, backstage entrance. I knew I was missing something. Swig of dust. Woohoo. It's my empty rants of the clown swear jar. It stays empty now because no one's here but me and Lil Beeper. It's a box with a crank on it. It's my tube of Coslerick's patented anti itch medicine. Works wonders. He's totally rubbing cream on his pants. So much for better. But I got an achievement for it. Uh, 35G, itchy fingers. Use the itch cream. <laughs> okay. Oh, what's the box? It's a box with a crank on it. With a crank, okay, fine. <laughs> Okay, I don't know what that is, but... There's an inch-thick layer of dust on it. Hasn't been used in years. What a f***ing of a still doesn't work! I'm just gonna make him do that at every well, single mirror now. at least I tried. My phone keeps buzzing. Okie dokes. So. We have a snake in a box. It's my joke book, but there's one page missing. Where the f is it? Okay, so 43 more specks of dust. Might be that many more in the game, possibly. wonder if it'll go down if I collect with someone else. Um... I just still don't know where Little Beeper is. Um, package, I've got to get out first, so need something to put popcorn in. I'm not a one Ooh, hang on. pirate. You'll never get me to climb into one of those. There's nothing inside but a couple of pennies. Yeah, can I pick it up, There's please? There's nothing inside but a couple of pennies. Ah, that would work for the popcorn. Okay, the rat piled all the popcorn. I don't want to pick that up. Uh, okay, so putting the cheese by that hole meant all the popcorns piled up there. 
for some reason. Maybe... Oh, I'm just grass can be destroyed now. Oh, okay, I can't use it with something. Hmm. It's my next lawyer's business card. Brent okay. Bailiwick JD. Legal problems? We'll screw them for you. I'm in the phone book. He definitely screwed me. I can't use it here. Ah. Fair enough. Okay, let's see what Dolores can do. Find out what happened to Dad. <laughs> Practice ASCII tables. Get key to factory gate. Oh, lots of people want to get key to factory gate. Go talk to the lawyer in the library and collect 43 more specks of dust. So obviously, everyone can collect. This clock looks specs. vaguely familiar. Maybe more highly rendered and smoother pendulum action. He. <laughs> the fireplace is very sooty and filled with ash. Great. Now I'm carrying around a handful of black soot. Yes, but last time we did that, we made ink. Ooh, speck of dust, speck of dust. Sweet. Okay, so. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. Ooh, there is a can of poopsie. Hee <laughs> hee. There's nothing inside. 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 There's nothing I think inside. There's nothing inside. <laughs> okay, so I know where the library is. That's the library because that's where it was before. So let's have a look in my room. Hello, room. These are part of my action figure collection. Graphics basic and enhanced basic. Unlock the full potential of your computer with over 100 additional English language commands. Now beginning programmers can create complex graphics, animation, and music without being a machine. Sounds perfect. It's my state-of-the-art Commodore 64 with dual 1541 floppy drives and a bl It's my state-of-the-art. Hmm. The Printron 3000 was Uncle Chuck's final invention before he died. It's connected to my... It's a red gel decoder. Never got to use that last time. It's the math trophy I won when I was 12 and attending a summer program at Thomas Bottomans. These are in mint condition. Okay, no way I'm going action. to touch them. Look at the trophy. <laughs> Tube printer. Ooh, ASCII chart. It's my handy ASCII chart. Never know when you'll need to decode binary messages, so I always practice every day. Yay, practice. Woohoo. Did a thing. Ada, you're my role model. Too bad you don't program games, though. Ooh. Max was this. the world's first computer-generated TV host. Someday we'll have one for... Okay. Ooh! Hello! Hi, Doug. Doug! What are you digging? All right, Dolores. I'm just digging stuff in the grand lobby. Mostly holes. But then I buries them again, all neat and tidy. Okay, Doug. You're doing a good job. Ta, Dolores! Is he called Doug because he has a spade? And thus he is... Dugging? It feels lonely without Uncle Chuck around. Looks like an old receipt. It's a receipt from the town's electronics store. One vacuum tube puller paid in full. It's Uncle Chuck's check register. He's dead now, so... I'm not going to carry this big checkbook around. I don't know why Uncle Chuck never let me touch this junk. Nothing here of value. Hmm. Uncle Chuck was always very touchy about this painting. Wonder why. Ooh! There's something written on it. 
Key. Pick up. Key. Sweet. It's a key. Hmm. It says office on it. There's two S's. <laughs> okay. The safe is locked, but there's a fingerprint reader on it. Okay, so use... I knew it wouldn't work for me. Ah, oh, okay, fine. It's a defunct robot prototype. I don't know why Uncle Chuck never let me touch this junk. It's a spare AT-25 tube. Very rare, hard to find. It's a box, fine. but it's sealed shut. Nothing in here but broken Tron 3000 vacuum tubes. Nothing in here but broken Tron 3000 vacuum tubes. Too bad Uncle Chuck never finished working on him. It's Uncle Chuck's custom-built multi-band oscilloscope with phase memory monitoring. Okay. I may have picked up something. Speck of dust. Yay! Speck of dust. Dig it. Duck again. Okay, you're weird, duck. Sorry, but you're weird. Right, let's go to the library. What's that? Oh yeah, poopsy. Okay. Where the hell have you been, Dolores? We're all here waiting for you so we can start the reading of Uncle Chuck's will. Take a okay. chill pill, Lenore. I had to answer the door. It was one of those federal agents. I don't care if it was the flippin' Pope. Let's get on with it, sister. I want to know what I got. Hmm. Wait, I thought you said everyone was here. Where's the lawyer? I don't know. I thought he was coming with you. <sighs> oh, Lenore, you're useless. Has anyone tried calling him? Well, maybe if you hadn't left town and broken Uncle Chuck's heart, we wouldn't need to call the lawyer to read a will. This is all your fault, Dolores. Okay, fine. Blame me. Chucky. Lenore. Chuck the plant. Peter. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm at the I'm staircase. Should I- I'm at the staircase. I'm at the staircase. Should I use it? Yes, go up the staircase, please. I me just reading a few books. Now spend whatever looking at books. <laughs> I 
I feel like I need to appreciate the effort that the backers have gone into. Oh dear, if you, yeah, I uh, just um, don't like this whole mindfulness thing. Healthy with head cheese, wonderful. Dead body's the guide. Attack of the hamsters! They're coming! Oh. Hmm. <laughs> this page intentionally left blank. How meta this is. Hippos make great pets. That's awesome. Oh, hang on. There's something about pancakes. The roundness of pancakes. Nice. Alright, let's have a see what's downstairs. And now probably boring everybody to death. But it's so funny looking at books. At least I think it's funny. Sammy's Socks. The Art of Book Burning. Fascinating death rituals. Later Roman <laughs> moustaches. <laughs> That's awesome. Blank pages. This page is intentionally left blank. The Anchelet Wars. Oh, hang on. That's in a different language. Can't speak. One, two, three, immortality. I could seriously spend a very long time looking at these. Bad romance book. Oh no, I read that one already. The 
That is a really terrible story. <laughs> I was waiting to end up reading porn or something. That would be quite funny. Oh, okay. Get your money in. Oh, to get you money in the mood. You're making your money. Get it to breed. Okay, that just sounds weird. <laughs> oh, Scuff, this is like your jokes. Jill broke her finger today, but on the other hand, she was completely fine. <laughs> hole was found in the wall of a nudist camp. The police looking into it. <laughs> uh, broken puppets for sale. No strings attached. Uh, <laughs> this is my favourite one, I think. It's not that the man did not know how to juggle. He just didn't have the balls to do it. <laughs> In Seattle, lollipops are prohibited? Okay, some of them are weird. Antoinette said to make brioche, which is not quite the same as cake. <laughs> this is Monkey Island! Coconut shy, but I'm working on it. <gasps> I'm checking Guybrush. Oh, these are cool. Maybe I should have backed so I could have had a book. I think I'm going to be in the credits. I mean, okay, maybe I should have backed at the level so I could get a book. But uh, I will be in the credits. I'm hoping to get a, a screen grab of it at least. Looking up your potential. One thing you should unleash your potential. Huh. <laughs> 
make him one of you? Something with chocolate peanut butter? Okay, that's just weird. Effective communication. <laughs> That's funny. I should probably continue with the story at some point, but this is quite amusing. Oh! Oops. Bookworm, 50G! Read 100 books in the library. Ah, okay, cool. Alright, that probably means that I've been doing that for Dolores, a long time. Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Chucky okay. doesn't want to talk to you. Okay, we got off on the wrong foot. Let's try again. It's good to see you again, sis. It's been too long. And whose fault is that, sweetie? I'm certainly not the one who abandoned the family in their hour of need. Also, mm. have you called much? the stupid lawyer yet? I want to get the will read and see how little Uncle Chuck left you. Do you know anything about Dad's disappearance? Dad probably ran off to hide somewhere. It's amazing that Dad and Uncle Chuck were cut from the same genes. One a powerful leader and the other, well, uh, spineless. Don't talk Jellyfish. about Dad like that, Lenore. You're so cruel. How is Chuck Jr. doing? Chucky is thriving. Some people say he's a brat, but those people just don't recognize his blossoming leadership abilities. Nah, no he sounds doubt like a brat. Up from Chuck Sr. because he certainly didn't get them from his father. Mm. How are things with Peter? Fine. Just peachy. I can't mm. believe we've only been together 20 years now because it feels like a flippin' eternity. So Uncle Chuck really hated me? Can you flip and blame him? You broke his heart when you left to become a you know what. A game developer? <laughs> oh shh. <laughs> not a dirty you word. <laughs> Is my career really that shameful? Oh hell yes, sweetie. Then what do you tell people I do instead? We just tell people you went to rehab. It's better <laughs> for the family name. You tell people I'm a drug addict? Better they think that than know you chose to make those mind-corrupting murder simulators for a living. For the last time, Lenore, I don't make murder simulators. Oh, sure you don't, sweetie. Ugh. You know what? I don't care. Tell them whatever you like, you grody poser. But this makes us even for the time I used your homecoming crown as a conductor in my homemade generator. Ha! Would it kill you to help out a little? I wasn't the one who abandoned the family. I was always there for Uncle Chuck. So it's time for you to finally lift a finger and help out. Oh, gag me. All you were ever there for was a handout from Uncle Chuck. Oh, Dolores, I won't shed one tear for you when the will is read and Uncle Chuck left everything to me. It'd be so hilarious if he leaves everything to me. I think <laughs> we're done here. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Dolores, if you have anything to say, you say it to me. Peter is embarrassed to talk to a... Um, you know what? Alright. Use... Phone. Ah. I don't know what number the lawyers are, so I'm just going to bring a random one. G'day, you've reached Jono. I'm not here at the moment, but no worries. Leave a message and I'll get back to you. Okay. Uh, get lawyer to read uncle's will. Any idea? It's a receipt from the town's electronics store. One vacuum tube puller paid in full. 
any idea what the lawyer is called? L for lawyer? Have you called the stupid lawyer yet? Who is the stupid lawyer? I think we're done here. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Chucky's been in our family for years. He's a good plant. I need to... It's my next lawyer's business card. Brent Bailiwick JD. Legal Brent I'm in the Bailiwick. phone book. He definitely screwed. Brent Bailiwick. Okay, let's see if we can use the phone. Oh, hang on, telephone. Brent Bailiwick. So B. Brant Bailiwick JD. Okay, eight thousand and nineteen. Use telephone. Eight thousand nineteen. Hi there. This is Brant Bailiwick JD. Do you have legal problems? Then you've come to the right place. I'm out of the office today, prepping for ThimbleCon 87. <laughs> Try me later. Ah, okay. That's not terribly helpful. Have you called the stupid lawyer yet? I think we're done here. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Okay, fine. Um... I'm going to go to Main Street. Into the town hall and go down and use one of the machine arenas. Because I now have ID for the person. So use a passaporte in the face tron. There's Boris or whatever his name was. Pick up identity report. <laughs> suspicious German businessman Boris Schultz. Okay, apparently he's suspicious. Fair enough. Um, use fingerprint book. Fingerprint. So now we just need a fingerprint and a sample of blood from something. Okay, so get a face trauma report. Woohoo! And still not found the murder weapon. All suspicious. I need to go find the sewers. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to go put the report in here because. I like putting things in things. That sounded really dodgy. I know what it meant. So, use identity report. It doesn't seem to be working. Uh, okay. Okay, maybe 
see, I can't use it. if I can go out. What else is on my to-do list? Get key. Mm, find out I haven't did that. Oh, speck of dust! Speck of dust! Go! Cool. Alright. Once is enough. <laughs> Awesome. Right. Hotel? Because if she goes to the hotel, then maybe um, her dad can try and talk to her. I like that everyone can pick up dust. It amuses me. Dolores, how lovely to see you today. How may I be a boo of service? Did you see my dad just before he disappeared? I saw him, but I don't know, Abu, what happened to him. Funny thing, Abu, though. Yes? Please, tell me everything. That same day, a man with a large nose, Abu, checked in and then disappeared. Weird. Dad's nose isn't big, and you know what Dad looks like. How else may I be a boo of service? How's business been going? In this town? Always slow. You know how it is. How else may I be a boo of service? I'm going to check out the beautiful lobby. Goodbye. Have a nice evening, Abu. I can't... The only other... The only th no, really annoying thing is you can't interact with the other players. The other players. The other characters. It's really annoying. Okay. Hello. Float to Dolores. I wonder what the guest is up to now. Dolores, it's Dolores. me, Dad. Aww, bless. I'm really proud of you for getting that programmer job. You followed your dreams and didn't let Chuck hold you back. I wish I could have, you know, been as strong as you. I want to give you a hug and say I'm sorry. I wish I'd, you know, stood up for you against Chuck. I wish I'd stood up to Chuck. Chuck pushed everyone around and used his charm to make everyone forgive him. I saw it and, you know, didn't do anything. Dolores, can you see me? I'm standing right here. Goodbye, Dolores. I miss you. Aww. That's really sad. Oh. Mom always said I wouldn't amount to much. Ooh. Okay, so at least I can. I love you, Dolores. I'm very proud of you. Aww. Aww. That was really sad. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave it there because I'm getting tired and um, I will pick up the sadness. Oh, five hours, nearly six hours of streaming. Yes, I think everyone's going to get tired of hearing my voice. So I'm going to leave it there somewhere partially through part three. Yeah, I think it's, yeah, part three. So somewhere pas somewhere through part three, I'm going to leave it and I will revisit this probably at the weekend um, and listen to the Z to Z, was you Z segment to hear my, my review of this. 
and um, thank you very much as always for watching my stream and listening to me babble for in a long amount of time <laughs> and uh, I bid you all good night <laughs> <laughs>